Welcome to another Barker Gaming video commentary video. On this video, we'll be discussing about the AMD 6000 series launch. So, what is this video going to be about? Yeah, it's going to be basically about the 680 and the 680 XT founders and the AIB models. Well, here's what we can say about the a AMD Founders card. Finally, they have ditched the goddamn cursed fucking blower style, which is loud and inefficient. Yes, the card worked in Crossfire and whatever. AMD has officially killed off Crossfire support, so I think this is a pretty good thing for us and use DIY people and maybe the, you know, the giant pre-builds aren't too ha happy about having no blower cards. But yeah, overall, I think AMD shouldn't basically give us DIY PC builders blower cards and just give us the open face card. So yeah, um, AMD found this card, yeah. yeah. Seems to be the card that you buy for, you plug it in and out of box just works. No overclocking, you can just use your AMD Smart and Rage features to get the maximum out of that GPU. But sadly, I think overclocking on the Founders cards is going to be bit no as it is very power limiting. And when, it's, when a graphics card is power limiting, you're not going to be able to push high clock speed. Alright, so now let's talk about the AIB models. The AIB model seems to be more, well, a better and more efficient style open card, which lets you have higher power target at similar um, noise as the AMD Founders card, or even better than the AMD Founders card. And basically, with those AIB models, it has truly reached the 680 and the 680 XT limit of both fre of frequency. And at that point in time, you don't really need to inject the extra voltage to go extreme overclocking. Which, yeah, I think majority of people... AI, just choose whichever AIB models that you like. You're going to get, you're just going to be able to drag that overclock bar to the max and you will be fine. So, but however, what's the current situation of the, as the recording of the video, the 6000 series, the 680 and the 680 XT, yeah, it's pretty much stock non-existence due to the fact of well the current world situation and as well as the current you know predicament of people just want a freaking upgrade their pc from their old whatever really old graphics card because people with the current world situation and everyone being shut inside yeah they just want some way to entertain themselves which some people have and gone build, needing to go build a new PC. As a result, a lot of PC parts are in high demand and graphics card right now is one of them. So basically, yeah. However, if you're one of those people that's like, I just want a good card and I don't care about any model, yeah, you may be able to spam F5 and get them, but if you're one of those people that's be like, I will only buy one brand and one brand only, yeah, you may find yourself, mm, can't find stock because, you know, there's only ever so much we can ship to ship and ever AIB gets allocation and then that AIB will have to allocate it to multiple countries and regions. And maybe that your region don't get a lot of allocation. 
So basically, be flexible with your graphics card. If you are, you will easily get stock. Get a graphics card. But if you're one of those people that's really picky, yeah, I think you're going to need to sit tight and wait for stock. So, in conclusion, what I can say is the 6000 series is a great product. It's, again, uh, AMD finally has come back to high-end gaming, which is a good thing. Which we goddamn need some competition in the high-end graphics card market before the NVIDIA basically runs over, runs us over with every generation price hiking the shit out of us and making us pay an arm and leg for our graphics card. Um, so this will be all this video for now. Comment below on what you want to hear, want me to talk, discuss about, hmm. And yeah, thanks for other people. Thanks for sticking around the video. I hope I've um I you like this video and you subscribe for this channel for more of Barker Gaming commentary video. Thank you.